Hi! Day two of the HH journey, which is Hollywood Hames, which is me. Hello! Um, I just recorded a video and it was like eight minutes long and it was like amazing and I felt proud. I was ready to upload it and the audio was gone. So that's real sad. Um, anyway. <laughs> My video, which is probably going to be way shorter since I rambled so much on the last one and I'm not editing things and I'm already starting to ramble, is just basically a recap. Yesterday I posted a video, I was kind of giving you guys insight into what I'm doing, why I'm doing it, and as we go along you'll learn more about me, my struggles, my successes, and kind of where I'm coming from. And my mind, being an Aquarius, my mind's always rolling and thinking and and not in the, oh, 2 plus 2 is 4 kind of way, but in, like, I, just, I overthink everything, I analyze everything, I, it, my brain's like crazy. Um, so, you'll learn along the way. But, I wanted to say that last night, after doing that hour-long workout with Jeremy, I felt good, I left, and he, he was like, you're gonna have so much energy, we should really work out in the mornings, and like, we're gonna do that now, because I was up forever last night. But even though I was up forever, I woke up at eight o'clock this morning, like, wide awake, I was like, ooh, ugh. And like, stretching like this, I was like, oh, my hands are, my arms, oh. And then like, I was trying to get up, and I couldn't, like, I was like, oh, oh, just roll off the couch, fat boy. And I had to, because, Every inch of my body is sore, which means that I did things properly and I did a good job. And it's not sore in the, oh my God, you've pulled something, but in a, your muscles really felt it, which is amazing and great. So I'm really excited about doing another workout tonight. Um, me and Jeremy and possibly Rachel are going to do something different. He said something about jumper, jump training jump training I think is what he said so I have no idea what that means I'm learning as every time is such a learning experience I learned how to do 22 different exercises last night that I had never done before and some of them were fun some kind of felt silly some were really hard some I don't ever really want to do again but I I know that it's in place and it's in a process to get me where I need to be I discovered that I can't really do push-ups. <laughs> and I know that as time goes on, I will get better at them. So as long as I'm doing the best that I can do each time, then within, you know, as time goes on, I will be so proud of myself for pushing and continuing to do so. Um, and Rachel usually does Zumba, which I have no idea anything about that, obviously. Um, but it's dance, aerobics, cardio, something with dance, fun. So she may not go to that and may hang out with us and do our workout. Um, but I definitely want to try Zumba sometime with her. I'm kind of thinking maybe next week or the week after, like, really try to work that in because I think that that sounds like fun. I love music, and I love to shake my booty. So definitely want to do that. Also... Um, after waking up sore, I was like, holy crap, what do I do? It's 8 o'clock in the morning. What do you, what do people do before 2 p.m. on days off? Like, I normally sleep in. I'm like, mm. So I had all this energy, and I was ready to go. Um, I ate a breakfast at, like, 8.30. Like, pfft, I haven't done that since, like, since that one time that I got really, really drunk and stayed up till 8.30, but that doesn't count. Um, so yeah, so I haven't really done that in years and years and years, I'm sure. And that's horrible because I need to do that. Um, so getting on that routine and hopefully in the next couple of weeks, like go grocery shopping, maybe film some of that, um, cook, have some people over for dinner, maybe make dinner, that's the goal, or have them teach me how to cook while making dinner. That's how that's how we're gonna roll in my house. If you wanna eat dinner over here, that's fine. But the only way we're gonna do that is if you help me cook it, because I don't know what I'm doing. So if you guys have any recipes or anything, please share those. Because I I need I need some no. I need some knowledge. And I don't need like, oh put two eggs and three this and that and put a cup of this and 
yeah, no, you need to do all of that, but then be like, I like this brand of this because I went and made, I made cheesy potato, loaded potato soup from O'Charlie's, which mine was just like theirs and it was amazing. I was really proud of myself. But like looking at the list of ingredients, I was like, white, white pepper? What kind? White, what? and then it said like hot sauce. And I was like, does that mean Tabasco? Is that what kind of jalapeno juices? Like, I didn't know. But I, it was really good. Anyway, um, what else? Oh, and then after that, like, I was gonna, I got ready for my walk. And my friend, like, texted me right as I was getting ready. And he was like, hey, did you go for your walk yet? And I was like, no. And I was like, what's up? And he's like, well, let's go walk. And I was like, sweet. So I don't have to do it alone. Which meant I was going to spend some time loading up the phone with some music and stuff. So, we ended up going to a park nearby and walking across this really cool bridge. And, like, we did three miles. And I was out of breath. And I sweated. And I felt gross. But it felt really good because with the muscles being sore, my arms, my legs, it was kind of nice to, like, stretch and get that all out and be outside. It's, like, 60 degrees today. It's sunny. It's beautiful in Nashville today. So, it was really nice to kind of get out and enjoy the atmosphere and the environment and laugh with a friend while talking and walking and blah, blah, blah. So that was really good. So shout out to Mike for that. Thanks for going with me, buddy. Um, what else? See, I babbled so long. I'm trying to remember what I said in the last video because there were some things I wanted to mention. Um, basically, this is day two follow up. I'm gonna work out tonight. Tomorrow I'll post something. I kinda wanna post a blog because I really like to write it out, express it. It's like a mental dumping ground for me. And videos for me are very much the same thing, but I feel like maybe they're more or less entertaining because I spend a lot of time talking and I try to get it all out as quick as possible and you get to see my beautiful face. But at the same time, like I babble on and on. Like with writing, I'm like, hmm, no, take that out. Okay, add this. Use creative words like, it was scrumptious and the weather was so divine and things like that. Um, so I really enjoyed that kind of process. So maybe my next update will be a blog. Um, so if the videos go from like day two to like day six, it's because there was blogs in between. Either way, facebook.com slash Dustin Hames, twitter.com slash Dustin Hames, and, or Hollywood Hames, sorry. And um, I revamped my website. So go to hollywoodhames.com, check it out. Let me know what you think. Let me know. Let me know. Um, and I'll end it on this. I'm sin like sincerely <laughs> ecstatic about how I feel after working out and that relaxation, yet that energy, that drive. Um, and I encourage everybody to do it for a few days in a row. See if you get the same effect. Like... I don't know, it's, a, it's an amazing feeling. And I'm really, like, pleasantly surprised at the amount of feedback I've gotten so far. From text messages, to emails, to tweets, to Facebook comments, and messages, and likes, and sharing my video, and commenting, and... It, it just, it makes me feel good. And I appreciate that. And I'm just glad that I can share my kind of experience with you and let you know what's going on and take you along for this journey. And as we go and as we continue, there'll probably be days where I cry and I'll be like, oh, that's so sad. Um, and it probably will be because I know that like my emotions are like, like I'm just an emotional person and I don't hold back and I love sharing um, because somebody learns from it. I learn from it by sharing because I get different perspectives and advice and and all of that, and then maybe somebody else will learn from my experiences too. Um, so it's pretty raw and non-edited for your pleasure. Um, ooh, that sounded dirty. Sorry. Um, hi, Mom. I'm giving a shout out because my mom watches all of these. I love you, Mom. And um, now I'm just babbling. It's like that award speech where they're like, get that bitch off of it. Um, yeah. All right, well, day two over now, another update to follow. Thank you for the continued support and subscribing and watching and commenting, blah, 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 blah. All of that really does mean a lot to me. So you guys have a good day and love you all.